Hi, my name is Sandy, and you're watching Saturday in the Y Rebels. Whoa, I just did a jump cut. It's been so long since I've done a jump cut. So anyway, this week's topic is our writing bucket list, or all our writing-related goals that we want to do before we kick the bucket. For me, I just really, 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 really want to get a book deal. I mean, I know it's not really all about the money, and I would be happy to write without getting paid for it, but I would also be very happy to get paid to write so I can buy things like food that I would probably need in the future to support myself. Um, like Sarah, I don't think I'd ever write uh, adult fiction just because I don't think I'd be very good at it. Probably because I am the farthest thing from an adult that you could possibly be. I still act like I'm 15. I rely on my parents for a lot of things. On the other hand, that makes me very well equipped to write about, say, angsty teenagers. I'd say my bucket list is a lot like a Disney bucket list in that a lot of the things I like to write about are kind of Disney inspired or Disney related and Hey, Disney's pretty freaking awesome. These are the movies I grew up on, so of course I'm going to use those movies as a source of inspiration in my writing. I really like to write a high fantasy piece, something with a huge world like Graceling or Finnegan of the Rock. Because I like princess stories or zombie princess stories, you know, whatever. And speaking of fairy tales, I'd really like to do some sort of fairy tale retelling because those seem a lot of fun. Something maybe like Sleeping Ugly or Snow White and the Seven Pimps. I'd also really like to write some sort of historical piece because I like history. History can be fun to play with and fun to learn about. And that's why you should stay in school. And you know, if my book was ever made into a movie and they wanted to make it into a musical, as long as it appropriately fit the themes and the songs are catchy, I'd be cool with it. And that's pretty much it for my writing bucket list. I'll see you next week. Good day.